Nature is a wonderful thing. It gives us life, colour, beauty and the most incredible array of plants and animals, including ourselves. But just as it gives life, it also takes it away and the circle is complete. Now some plants like trees live to a ripe old age and can be remembered for those wonderful form or perhaps that beautiful shade. But what about us? What happens when we go, and I know we'll be remembered in the hearts and minds of our loved ones, but what about in a memorial way? Well, the best people to ask are here at Centennial Park. Pam, there must be so many different ways to be memorialised in Centennial Park. There are indeed. As you know, we're well known for our roses and we have over 7,500 roses. And it used to be just the rose gardens or the wall positions. Now you've got so many more options. You've got your individual roses, you've got your garden seats, you've got your individual trees, you've got your fountains, you've got the new Springbank Island. So there are various ways that people can be memorialised. What sort of needs do people have? They might like to be in the sun. In the full sunlight, they might like to be in a shady area, they might like a tropical, dad lived in the tropics, or mum liked the desert, you know, whatever it suits. So we try and work with the families and accommodate them the best we can in that area. Well Pam, it's fantastic here. Now, can you show me around? Absolutely, I'd love to. Now, the roses are always, as you said, 7,800. Yes. Um, beautiful roses, gold bunny. Now, Pam, when it comes to roses, mm -hmm. I mean, do you, are you given a rose or can you choose the variety or, um, I mean, how do you go about it? You can absolutely it? choose the variety and the colours. Colours are very specific with some families, so when they're wanting a particular colour, a, a typical variety, whether they want a bush rose or a standard rose, we'll bring them out here and show them the roses and what's available in the area and then they can choose their rose that they want. Well, I'm going to go Gold Bunny. Absolutely. One of my favourites. <laughs> okay. Well, show me more. So you've got your wall positions too, which people can still choose with your plaques and the ashes are placed inside the wall. Oh, actually. Yeah, in, oh. so that, that gets tapped out and then the plaque sits on the top. Yeah. And then you can choose a side by side for your husband and wife as well. Oh, nice. Yeah. Oh, Pam, this is beautiful. It is, it's magnificent in here. This is one of our tropical areas. So it gives shade to people and offers the tropical side of things or other times they can have the full sun. Covered by nature. Yes, absolutely. Pam, what's happening over here? Well, Kim, there are various ways people want to remember and honour their loved ones. So we encourage them to come into Centennial Park and have a picnic and sit there and be with their plaque and, their, you know, and just be with their loved one and just reflect on the memories. Thank you, Mum. So you can have a little glass of bubbly and absolutely. Have, um, yeah, have some memories? Absolutely. My mother's here and in, on her, her birthday my sisters and I gather and we have a brandy and coke with her because that's what I have after. Well, that was. sounds alright. Yeah. Now Pam, I know there are so many different spots around here. I'm, what I'm looking for is something which is north facing near a fragrant red rose with a bit of dapple shade in the afternoon. Oh, okay, is that for somebody special? Yeah, me. Oh really? Let's go. Okay, right. <laughs> 